It seems like it could be any day now that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle could be sharing their happy news that they are to wed. Sources have revealed that Meghan is set to be joining Prince Harry at the Invictus Games in Toronto near the end of September. Toronto is also Meghan's adoptive home as she films the legal drama suits there. The couple, who have been together for slightly more than a year, have been inseparable, with Meghan spending every free moment away from work at Prince Harry's cozy Kensington Palace abode. Rumors of an engagement swirled when Prince Harry whisked the actress and humanitarian away for a three-week holiday in Africa to celebrate her birthday last month. While not confirmed, it is also thought that her contract with Suits ends this year, which means a 2018 wedding is highly likely, arranged with the arrival of the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge's third child in mind. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have already broken tradition when Meghan graced the cover of Vanity Fair last week speaking of the great love story between her and Harry. The interview would not have taken place if the palace or Harry did not give it his blessing. We're two people who are really happy and in love. I hope what people will understand is that this is our time. It's part of what makes it so special, that it's just ours. Personally, I love a great love story, said Meghan opening up. Sources have noted that Harry and Meghan may be changing the way royal marriages have traditionally taken place. Harry will push hard for Meghan to be able to have a career in her charity interests outside of her royal duties. A source speaking to the Times said, I don't think the Queen will stand in the way of a more modern kind of royal marriage. She backs her grandsons to the hilt. The palace courtiers must not stand in the way. If Harry is frustrated on this, it will be to the royal family's detriment.